we are the guys who know what we are doing. You know, we are here to prove it. I'm confident with that. All right, hey guys, welcome back to Train with JC and Bala. I'm JC and this is Bala. <laughs> and uh, Bala is back. Bala, where were you? I went to Bangalore. Yeah. Okay. Family stuff. <laughs> Family stuff, yep. Understandable. So, did you see the video? We. Yeah. I'm going to We had to do an improv. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Okay. I'll I'll wait for an opportunity like that again. <laughs> I'm, I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. At least till the series ends. <laughs> we'll do one. Okay. Time time for update. So Bala, before I go and uh, update about Deepak, maybe you ought to talk about what you've been doing with Sapna. Last week, uh, you know, we discussed with Sapna, and she told me that you've reduced her calories further. Now, I think there was some communication gap, so you might want to clear that up. How many calories she's at? Last week she was at 1400, 1375 mm -hmm. ish. And I had to reduce it because I have to maintain that rate of loss. Hmm. And she's already doing decent amount of activity, good number of training sessions. Hmm. The third variable which I can control is calories. Yeah. And anyways, I add that extra calories in the form of chocolate and ice cream. So I like remove that content. Right. The base diet is there. So she is satisfied with that. Now this week, what I've done is I generally give her, you know, a maintenance week mm -hmm. once in a while so that, you know, the diet induced stress is gone. She will perform really well in the gym. And if there is any water retention also, that will also be gone. So, this week she has been doing 1750 to 50 calories. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. very interesting. So, and uh, her performance is shooting up like anything. Right. When she started strip leg deadlift at 15 kg dumbbells mm. in the mm. first week. Mm. Now, today morning she did 35 kg dumbbells strip leg yeah. deadlift. Wow. Like, okay. Crazy strength gains. And it's showing up in the physique as well. Right. So basically what you did was you cut down on her calories and then now you increase the calories again and knowing well enough that she's not going to gain more weight at the same calories. Yes. Right. Yes. She will explain that. Anyway. Explain that a little bit. So uh, people think that, okay, now that I've cut, cut down the calories to a lower limit, as soon as I increase calories, I will gain weight. But mm -hmm. you have to understand that once you come down to the calories a certain level, you're still in deficit. Yeah. It's not like there was any no reduction of weight or inches or any fat. So going back to maintenance is what you have to target. Now, when I started, I assessed her maintenance to be around 1850, 1875. Hmm. So now 1750 might be her new maintenance because some amount of mass is lost. Right. Some amount of fat. But she is not in surplus. She's so not the chances in surplus. of her gaining weight is next to none. Uh, but at the Weight same time, might happen, but yeah. again, uh, it can be because of extra carbohydrates storing as glycogen right, with right. water. Yeah, but fat largely water fluctuations. Yeah, water. But she won't gain fat. No. Yeah. All right. And what will happen because of this entire week of 1700 is that the the thermogenic adaptation which happened. Um, again, that will be relaxed a little bit. It will relax a little bit, and so you can and then aggressively cut more. Performance is also performance, going to yeah. boost okay. up. So that's okay. what we are seeing this week. Right, interesting. And how is her parameters looking? She has lost 3.2 inches so far in the waist. Mm. So that's, I think, in line with what I'm targeting, like 4 inches this month. So let's see by end of. You said how many week. inches? Sorry, 3.2. So, I'm so getting still to have point 0.8 inches this month. For this month. Huh. But I was short in the first month. But this month, I think I'll do 2 inches for sure. Okay. So, I'm confident with that. Well, in case of Deepak, things are not as exciting as in Bala's case. And that's how I prefer things to be. Deepak still has 2,000 calories. And today, we did the weight measurement. Uh, today's weight is around 111 kgs. 111. Wow. So, that's total loss of 15 kgs 15 in the last yeah. uh, 52 days. Yeah. And we have another 40 odd days. We should be able to touch 100 without any problems. I mean, you still have another eight days in this month, seven days in this month. And so basically that means that he will lose another two kgs. We'll end up at somewhere around 109 by the end of this month. And then you'll have nine kgs to lose. Getting closer next to the month. target. <laughs> we, I'm, I'm pretty confident. And the best yeah. part is I still have a lot of leverage. A lot of leverage, yeah. We didn't cut down on calories. calories. 2,000 <laughs> calories. We are still at 2,000 calories. We are still walking. Now he's walking around 7,500 steps as opposed to 6,500, which he did in the last month. So 7,500 steps. And most probably next month, I'll put him on 8,500 steps. Right. Okay. And he's becoming stronger. He can now do 35 push ups in a row. 
now uh, which is pretty decent and now i mean for that body weight it is not decent it is actually great uh, yeah i mean Amazing. the form is not still perfect but like i've told before that you know the form is something it's always like it's something that's always in the works you can't have perfect form from day one so you build up the strength and over a period of time your form keeps on getting better just make sure that you don't injure yourself right so that's about it so i'm pretty happy and deepak is also feeling lighter every day he comes to the gym he is looking more happier excited and uh, he has this childlike enthusiasm where he wants to you know build muscles and i've told him that in 2 years time we'll wo- both work out shirtless in the gym and so <laughs> you know just <laughs> doing a new or more interesting more challenging goals i'm enjoying this and i guess we should be able to achieve all the targets we originally set out to do again tapna is doing amazing i think she is the most excited <laughs> i mean you should see the messages i get from her it's like okay she's she's like a child seeing okay i can see cuts here i can yeah. see cuts here just posting on instagram also these days nice. about that so she is more enthusiastic i can you know i love to say that Well, I guess that's it from our side yes. this week. Yeah. And uh, if you have any particular topics in mind that you would like me or Bala to discuss, you've seen how both of us we have a different approach. I don't prefer diet breaks. Uh, my calories are pretty much linear, um, and you know I keep it very relaxed. But that's also because I'm training a completely different person. The approach would have changed if it was some other person. Yeah. If it was an athlete, I'd be more aggressive. And if Bala was training obese guy, his approach would be far more conservative, yeah. like mine, right? So yeah. at the end of the day, it all depends. You know, there's no one size fits all. There's no one trick that applies to everybody. You have to adapt your training style to each and every person that you're training. And that's what I guess you know you you learn when you have experience training so many people. And uh, I hope you guys appreciate what we are doing. You know, there's a lot of people who just talk, 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 but when it comes to results they can't and after having trained thousands of people and I've I've personally trained hundreds of thousands of people in the past I don't train people for money but experimentally I've trained a lot of people and uh, this is again my third life transformation after Nosh Ayer and Jamie and totally random person I think uh, at this point it's safe to say that you know we we are the guys who know what we are doing and uh, you know when when we say that this is how things work You know, we are here to prove it, back it up. So I hope you appreciate that. Uh, with that, I think I'll see you guys next week. See you next week. Yeah. Take care. Bye bye.